We're here at ASUS booth in Computex 2024 and surprisingly they're doing it in the Langgang Exhibition Center Hall this year. And as you can see, there are uh, lots of people. Uh, as the Chinese saying goes, people mountain, people sea. But we do have quite a few things to highlight in this Acer booth here. So firstly, of course, one of the biggest announcements is the Copilot Plus PCs. These are all Swift 14 AI laptops. Yes, Swift 14 AI is the name of the laptop and then all powered by the Snapdragon X Elite chipset. Of course, as shown on this footage here, the controversial feature called Recall. Uh, I did have a chance to play with it here as well. So the Recall feature is in a way very good for those people who are forgetful. So for this laptop in particular, you can select up to 150 gigs of storage space to be allocated for the Recall feature. And I finally got to see where the AI part comes into play. So when you recall into a certain area of that timeline, then it will use AI to detect whatever is in that screenshot. So text, images, links, anything. They will just highlight a box for you, then you can move your cursor there, double click on it to select everything, then you can copy, paste, or even edit photos by just opening it in the photo editor app. That is very convenient. So on the other side of this Copilot Plus PC stand here, we have the Acer Swift Go 14. And it won the Best Choice Award, I think. I'm not sure what's the name of the choice. Yes, Best Choice Award, Computex Taipei 2024 Category Award, Acer Inc. Acer Swift Go 14. And the reason why I think they won this award is because this laptop is very thin and it is powered by the new Intel Core Ultra 9. Yes, the highest end Meteor Lake processor in a thin and nine laptop and the overall performance is obviously no joke, but uh, I don't have much time to play with it that much, but yeah, that's the laptop there. The other stand there, we have something special called Spatial Labs. So Acer has been doing this kind of 3D related things, uh, video capturing and also video display. And they put it under the whole brand called Spatial Labs. So what they demoed here is the Spatial Labs monitor where we can see things with 3D without wearing any glasses. So uh, the, the video will not show it in 3D, it will show it in some, some distorted lines and whatever because you need stereoscopic vision to see, like human eyes, left and right eyes. So the demo was a B and the B when they rotated it towards my, what I'm seeing, yeah, it, it's kind of scary and also kind of uncomfortable because it looks like it's gonna attack me. It, a giant beast is gonna attack me. So they have another demo where they showed off handbags. That's uh, good for shopping as well. And one important, very important demonstration they have is real-time video calls in 3D using Zoom and Google Meets and whatnot. So what they do is to split the video feed into half. So you've got left eye for one side, right eye for one side, and then they have a special 3D tracker, 3D camera, and then you can do 3D video conferencing. Then we also have Predator here. So Predator, uh, there are two things that I want to highlight. Number one is the Z57 monitor. That is a humongous 32 by 9 monitor. It technically has double 4K monitors on the left and right side combined into one big curved monitor. It is using mini LED. It's super bright, very responsive. And the monitor is just impossibly big. <laughs> That's all I can say. And uh, we also have the Helios 18 laptop as well. That also won another Best Choice Award. And that laptop, if you want the best gaming performance on the go, yeah, that, that laptop is seriously the one to get. And then also we have Predator PC DIY parts. So they do have AMD and Intel graphics cards. Surprisingly, there's no NVIDIA yet. So keep an eye out on that. Oh, and another one of the case that we did take a look like a year or two ago with a toolless design for all of the panels to, take, to be taken out. That case will be sold a la carte. So you can buy it on your own and then you install your own components in it. That is a great case design by the way. So that's all that we have to share with you about Asus booth in Computex 2024. If you do have time, then do drop by. Uh, as far as I know, Friday is open for public. So do come by and have a look. Remember to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next video.